welcome to episode 6. What I decided to do was go with the first save file, so where we went, we done the the 10 castle operations. So we're going to go with that. First save file is going to be our main one, and our second save file is going to be any extra missions. So we're going to buy the X-29, because why not? And, and we're going to go into Grease Lightning and see what this is all about. Reconnaissance discovered that an enemy base is being built in a deep ravine. Our enemy seems hard pressed to construct a new base in a hurry after losing their forward base. This time our target is the ravine base. The problem is a network of anti-aircraft missile sites surrounding the ravine region, making it impossible to carry out a bombing mission from above. To attack the base, we have to enter the edge of the ravine by flying at a low altitude and then make a hit and break away attack. This is the only way to attack this base. Target, the ravine base. The enemy's anti-aircraft missiles are highly accurate and there will be no chance of survival if you fly directly over the ravine. Watch your altitude. Well, this kind of mission seems familiar. We're going to take off and we're going to use the X-29, why not? Our new plane. So it's the typical flyer through the ravine, don't go above a certain height mission that we know and love. And it looks like we do have the occasional AA gun inside the ravine. Don't worry about wow, this feels Oh wow, that is so reactive. I'm gonna have to watch. I can see me crashing in this plane. Time isn't really an issue in this mission. Just make sure you get through it and don't crash and you're alright. We're already halfway through the ravine already. Not much to say about this, it's pretty much just fly in a straight line, don't crash, don't go too fast. And just watch your turns, very much so watch your turns. I've done this kind of level so many times because it does at least one in each Ace Combat game, I think. I think there's even one in air combat. It's not a bad mission type. It's not even that overdone, to be honest. I think even Dropship United Peace Force had a mission like this as well. Yeah, it did. Yeah, one of the very first missions. Took a leap out of Ace Combat book. I'm dead. That was a very tight... <laughs> Tight, tight, tight. Turn. All right, I think I'm pretty much back to where I was. Um, the X-29 was just far too reactive and far too... It was just too unstable for this kind of mission. So I, I took it to KC-37 instead, and I'm having a bit of a better time with it.
so far anyway until I die. Which will be any second probably. Just the colours on these mountains are very weird. I'm pretty sure this is where I died. Because I can barely make a, a distinction between... It's just... yeah. Well, we definitely made it past the bit where I died. Here we go. Mission done. Took me a second attempt, but we still managed it. Didn't get a lot of money from that, but that's fine. We are a staff sergeant, so it looks like, yeah. We got the A10. Ah, the A10. Mm. I need to buy that. Right. Oh, we've got another. I need to buy that, like, right this second. Oh, I don't have enough money. Uh... Next time. Next time. Anyway, when we come back, we'll be doing Midnight Assassin. And then we'll do Attack on the Mine as a as the second kind of we'll, we'll check that out but they both should lead to the same mission it's just you have an option of these two so join me next time for operation midnight assassin